It is so true that playing other games screws you up playing other games, right? It's like, because I've been playing Mario 1, 2, and Super Mario World more than I've been playing Mario 3, like, Mario 3 is so messed up for me right now. That now that I'm playing Mario 3, I should probably only play Mario 3. But I don't know, man. Risky business. Yes. Yes. Yes, guys, we did it. Oh no, fat kitty, not your tail. Dude, we've had this conversation before. I don't like I don't know why people think there's something wrong with Darb. That's what I'm talking about. Or two. Yes, two. That is what I meant. <laughs> Did you guys know that Mario 3 is actually a ROM hack for Doki Doki Relax? Darbian going on my couch? No. I don't think Darbian's ever run all forts before. I don't even think Darbian's gonna be at SGDQ. Oh my gosh. My dream, my dream couch. We got Doki Panic, Doki Doki Panic, Doki 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 Panic, and Super Mario World. <laughs> this was the last of the Dokis. What do you mean give you the skinny on Darb? Are you not familiar with Darbian? For someone who loves him so much, you seem to not be uh, aware of how he does things. For like... It's gotta be at least three years now. Darbian has always streamed with this kind of schedule. Darbian has always been a casual streamer. He's never streamed full time for years now. For years now. He's always played a game for a couple weeks and then he stopped because streaming's not his full time. He's never done full time streaming. He's always been a casual. How do you not know that? When have you ever watched Darb for more than like three months straight? Never. It's never happened. It's because he takes breaks. It's a hobby for him. It's casual. Listen, I miss Darb streams just as much as the next one, okay? I have nightmares because I don't get my fill of Darbian. But I also know until he's done playing video games forever, he's get he's coming back. He'll come back and play some more games. So just chill out, you know? There's lo lots of other fish in the sea. Alright, now, which direction am I going? That's right. Ooh, that's the hammer down there. That's still bad. I'm still, I'm still probably going to have to get the, the Mushroom House music box. Nice. 
Is Darby in my secret fiance? Maybe. It would be a secret if I told you now, would it? Oh my god, I can't believe I did that strat. I can't believe any of this is working right now. Guys, please remind me not to forget the fortress in World 3. Thank you, music box. Getting in my way. Yo, the G-Bot, what's going on, guys? And also, by the way, guys, thanks for bringing up Darby in again. Now I have to go back to missing him, and I have to, ooh. I have to go through withdrawals again and all that stuff. God, man. So feel free to skip it. No, we don't. We don't want a reset, okay? Nobody wants resets. Darb trapped in my basement. Well, again, I can't say if he is or. I get so angry. I mean, I mean, I don't get that angry. Pick my big buck. I don't get that angry, okay? I get like, I yell at the game, okay? I swear at the game. And then like three seconds later, I'm okay. It's not like, it's hard for me to justify. I don't know how many of you watched me play Mario 3 like four years ago, but that was actually getting angry at the game. That's the real anger. I used to get really, really mad. I've calmed down a lot. Okay, I've calmed down a lot. I've tried, I've tried, okay guys? I think, <laughs> I think the weirdest thing is that in my entire life, the most I've ever changed is strictly for streaming. That's the most I've ever changed. I've changed who I am the most for streaming. Clips from four years ago? Uh, there might be clips. If there was clips from four years ago, it would be, it would be on Twitch. But I don't think they're, I don't think they're actually there. Uh, no, four years ago they didn't have clips, but they still had highlights and stuff. I don't think sub count is a command. Yo, thank you for the 10 bits, man. Good on me for making the change, yeah. I mean, that, that change hasn't really done much.
the change only affects like how I am like on stream for for people, right? Although I can't say I can't say quitting smoking was strictly for stream, but stream had something to do with it. People did express a lot of opinion on me being a smoker, and uh, I don't know. It helped people. People don't bug me as much, obviously, because I'm not smoking. If I was still a smoker, people would still be bugging me a lot about being a smoker. So I mean, that stress is at least gone. No, I won't forget the fortress. Hard read, he's gonna- no, 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 I, I'm not gonna forget it. But thank you guys. What? What? Move your ass, Mario! It's easy to quit smoking before age 25. I started smoking at 19 and I stopped smoking at age 28. In 10 days, I will be one full year off smoking. Oh my god, dude. You're gonna play Mario 3? There's lots of people who play Mario 3. Mario 3 is a very popular game. Or is it? Yep, June 1st of last year, I was like, fuck cigarettes. May, at the end of May, the last day of May, I finished my entire pack of cigarettes. I was like, I had that mentality of like, oh, I, bet, I can't waste them. I got to smoke them all. And like, that's the mentality of someone who, who's not going to quit smoking. But come June 1st, I like the next day after smoking an entire... Doki Doki withdraws. Oh my god, that's so jokes. Doki Doki smokes some. How much money do I think I spent on cigs? I know how much money I spent on cigs. Normally every year the price of cigarettes went up like something stupid, like 20, 25 cents of so dumb. But in Canada, I was smoking a pack of Canadian Classics. That's what the brand was. They were called Canadian Classics. And they were about... When I first started smoking Canadian Classics, when I was about 20... 20 or 21 because I smoked the same brand for a long time. They were probably about ten dollars And whenever I stopped smoking cigarettes whenever I stopped smoking, they were about fourteen dollars a pack So for like two years, I'd say I probably spent fourteen dollars a day on cigarettes For about two years and then for about four years it was probably like, you know, 12 to 13 dollars and then for the first like two to three years smoking cigarettes it was like 10 10 to 12 bucks so do the math a smoker an addictive smoker a habitual addictive smoker never stops smoking so you can actually calculate that price through every single day 365 days when you are an addictive habitual smoker there's not a single day that you don't have a cigarette or there's not a single day where you don't do your normal smoking habits. You guys done? I'm trying to remember these levels.
Yeah, and I, I went through, I went through pretty close a pack a day, maybe, maybe a pack a day and a half. All right, Hammer Brothers, this is just getting a little ridiculous. I'm losing like four seconds apiece from them. I still got it. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, like buy something nice for yourself every year from the money you saved. Here it comes, yep. Yeah. Of course he did, Matt, of course he did. One billion cigarettes in a day. Oh my god, you guys are so dumb. Billy Mitchell memes are back. Uh, yes, Sour Lime. It'll be on YouTube, though. save time almost save time wow I almost hit that bouncy block which probably would have caused me to get oh my gosh that's so bad that that just happened Once I start thinking about the other Mario games, it starts, like, messing with my brain of, like, the physics of this game. How's Dram World? Dram World's dope. Uh, I'll probably get the Fire Flower here. I think, I think a lot of you don't know that this Fire Flower exists, so I'll show you it. I'll show you it. So in a speedrun, people have the speedrunners have the option of coming down here and you get to do a really cool trick after. Watch, check this out. It's my favorite trick. Woo! I don't know why I just love that trick. But unfortunately, that's like a 10 second time loss getting that fire flower. That's a pretty big time loss. feels so tight, man. I can't wait until the feeling of like Mario 2 and 1 are out of my system. Uh, I have not played Celeste. Unfortunately, so 
Celeste doesn't interest me. I know, I know a lot of people had a lot of good uh, reviews and a lot of people loved Celeste. 67? Okay. Um, I didn't... It didn't appeal to me too much because I... I don't care for... Doing certain games where it's just like... Hold on a sec. I got lost there. Celeste was really good, I heard, yeah. I just wasn't interested. It doesn't mean I don't... It doesn't mean I don't think I would... Wouldn't enjoy it. I might enjoy it, but... It just hasn't caught me off guard enough where I'm like, I need to buy it. Yeah, baby. Play Mario Lost Levels, still waiting for it in the mail. I ordered it like two weeks ago. Oh, that save? I've never done that save before in my life. What? Of course. One level works and the other doesn't. Always. 77? Nice try. I mean, I don't need... I know I can beat Celeste, 100%. I know I can. The way I, the way I can do platform gaming... I know I could beat Celeste, but is it something that I care to, like, challenge myself with? No, not really. I don't really care. There's only so many hard jumps and hard obstacles I can do before it's it's dry for me. It's boring. It's not fun. However, though, not playing Celeste, like, I would put myself through something that's not overly appealing to me anymore, but it does hinder my chance of potentially maybe speedrunning it, which is what would make it fun, you know what I mean? Like, if I played Celeste, maybe I wouldn't enjoy it the way I would enjoy, like, uh, an open-world game, but maybe I would enjoy it more if I was, like, finding speed strats, right? Finding speed strats would put a lot of uniqueness into the game for me, which would change it up a bit, right? So maybe. You never know. Lots of people say they've had a lot of fun, but... Oh my god, Hammer Brother, are you serious? Like, do you have nothing better to do but to, like, literally... Go back and forth in that one spot over and over again. It's great to just kill some time, right on. I'm just as fast the same way for like 15 different ways. And that's like, that allows people to have so much creativity, right? That allows someone to like watch me do it as fast as possible and then them create their own path that's equally as fast. Yo, recall what up? Some of the levels branch out and can be done very differently. Okay, cool, yeah, see? So, for me not playing it, thinking that I might not enjoy it, I sacrifice, you know, it, that kind of exploration. But it's okay, because the game's not going anywhere. What is going somewhere is my skill and, like, practice I need. I need to make sure I stay on top of practice. Plus, um, I don't know. I didn't venture over to Celeste, I think, a lot because I wanted to, uh, I wanted to indulge in... All of the speedrunning games that I actually missed from speedrunning Mario 3 and like doing Mario Maker. I know I did speedruns of a lot of other games. However, um, whenever I started a big grind on Mario 3, it was like Mario 3. Like that was it. That is all I did. I played Mario 3 and... I don't even know what else I did with Mario 3. Probably like random games here and there. Like, during my Mario 3 era, I did Ninja Turtles 2, the arcade version, I did Metroid, I played a bit of Super C, um, bunch, bunch of NES games, I guess. But yeah, 
It's good times. No way. Okay. I was like, there's no way I got my P-Speed there. What? No! No! Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. No, and the screen scroll. I am hindered by the screen scroll. Alright, what you got? What you got, level? Oh, yeah. Make me take the stairs of death. I'm not gonna lie, I forgot where where to jump off these blocks. I totally forgot. <laughs> well, as long as they don't stay together. Lion Tamer, what's up? I got a music box to use anyway, so come on, game. Give me a reason to use it. Give me a reason! Oh, and it did. This game sucks. It doesn't. I love this game. Yeah, it's pretty cool but the good thing is is i've heard a lot of good reviews of celeste so if i'm ever feeling like oh i gotta want to play video games i can play it yeah if i ever feel the need to all right, how many tries are we gonna get the wall jump? Listen, okay? You know who you're dealing with? Oh. You wanna know what's worse? Is that when I go to GDQ, I gotta play on a CRT, so. My muscle memory for like single frame tricks and stuff. Oh man, I have to grind my butt off. But the one good thing that I look at when it comes to participating in, in GDQs is that I'm never too hard on myself because I know I'm switching TVs, which is one of the most like understandable things in video games. like. When someone only plays on a flat screen and switches the CRT or vice versa, it's highly respected. And that's what I normally do when I go to GDQ. Like, I, I play on flat screen, but when I go to GDQ, I play on CRT. So whenever I arrive, I think it's on a Monday, I get there, or a Sunday, it doesn't matter. I have three and a half days. I have three and a half days to get really good at Mario 3 on a TV that I do not use. Funds for my wedding. Just kidding. I don't need any funds, guys. I appreciate it, and I mean, it does keep me, you know, but yes. Why don't I get, I don't, because I don't want a CRT. I don't like a CRT. I think they're ugly. I think they're heavy. I think they're they're hot. I think they're staticky. They're ugly. I'm not taking my flat screen on a plane. It's just going to break. It's going to be silly walking through the airport with a flat screen. I'm not mailing it. I'm, I'm just going to go and I'm just going to adjust. I'll just adjust to it. I have before. That's what I normally do. It'll be fine. Uh. 
Oh, you're such a jerk. My head got caught in the ceiling. Yeah, CRT, like, I feel like CRTs depress me because they're so old. It makes me feel like I'm in the past and I'm not progressing, like, with the human race. I don't know why I just feel that way. That's why in my house, it's, like, very, like, not depressing. in Toronto. Why are you guys getting upset at my preferred choice in t TV? Like, what? Why do you guys care so much? At least I have, like, legitimate reasons of why I choose the way I play my games on, you know? That's why I like it like that pretty legitimate reason and if anyone's gonna complain it's gonna be me for the input delay that i have to put on but i keep my mouth shut i don't complain about it i really don't experience input delay but i don't complain about it so if anyone's gonna complain it's gonna be me wedding gift yo ikario thank you dude wow guys holy shit dude what the freugen friggin the Schmoigenleben. Yo, guys, give some love in chat for Ikario for that $50 donation as a wedding gift. Wow, thank you, man. Yo, mage, what's going on? Yo, thank you, man. Ram ba -dam bam 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 Yo, where's my star at? I tried to jump, that was so dumb. What am I supposed to do now? Yeah, those were the best pro strats I've ever done. Wish me luck. Wow, I saved 11 seconds. How? I died. Uh, I hate winter so much, so I can guarantee that the date is going to be next summer. Easily. Well, maybe not. A white wedding. Substituting over for the white Christmas. I don't know. A winter wedding's probably pretty cute, I guess. Disney's I Got Married. Am 
Am I gonna wear red coveralls? Obviously. God, get me out of here. That's the biggest tease ever. Don't clip that. That wasn't funny. Can't do these levels without P-Wings. What? I'll give you guys a thick and juicy P-Wing. Oh, I jumped too low. I was ready to guff up Bowser super thick. All I did was just jump a little too low. That's about it. I was worried about this level too. I was like, Mitch, don't mess that level up. Task, task castle incoming? Nah, I'll be there forever. But I will get back into SMB3 any percent though, obviously, since I'm gonna go back on the Mario 3 grind starting right now, I guess. How exciting, Mario 3. Cause I haven't done that game for like eight years. to make sure I don't use my star. Oh, come on. Ooh, I almost missed it. Sponsored by Pepsi. What's my shirt? I will show you what my shirt is in just a minute. Safety precaution right there. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Come on, Bowser. I've had enough of your shit. Are you okay, live split? Forty eight seventeen? Not bad. Uh this is my shirt. It's...
Yeah, take that, Vegeta. Yeah, it's Dragon Ball Z shirt. Oh, yeah, look at those sweat marks. It's, uh, it's the first battle with Goku and Vegeta. <laughs> I meant your shirt. 